The Bitcoin reached our symmetrical triangle target and right now is breaking down. Where this crash is going to stop? Let's analyze. Hello ladies and gentlemen, this is Simon from My Crypto Paradise. So you remember from the previous video, I have been sharing with you this target from the breakout of the symmetrical triangle. The Bitcoin have been consolidating for a little bit and now we are breaking down. So how low can we go? For that, let's analyze the Bitcoin on one hour time frame. This is lower time frame analysis for us. We are doing scalp trading based on this price action. And as you clearly can see, we have been consolidating inside of a symmetrical triangle because we've been making higher lows and lower highs. If you are in our free MCP school, you know exactly how to trade these patterns like a professional. You are waiting for the consolidation to go to the apex of this triangle and then you are waiting for a confirmation that we are describing on our website microtoparadise.com. So definitely go check it yourself if you want to be creating trades like a professional. So how low can we go right now? In order for that to predict with a high conviction we will use our price range tool right here and calculate the target of this symmetrical triangle breakdown. For that, we will place our counting tool at the bottom of the target. We place it to the top and then we take it, we place it to the point of the breakdown, which was right here. And we can see that we can go down as much as towards $69,000. That is also synergized very well with the previous price action, because as you can see, this level was perfectly working as a resistance and right now this important level will surely work as a great support considering that it's the target of the symmetrical triangle breakdown. This will be just a quick update video if you want to go really deep in what's going on on a higher time frame go watch the previous video where I have been describing everything what we want to see. Right now I will just repeat the basics because you know that we have been making on higher time frame the first higher high major higher high in seven months, right? Seven months we have been consolidating in this bearish structure and finally we have been able to break from it and create a first higher high. However, how can we understand if this breakout on a higher time frame is a legit breakout or just a fake out? For that we are measuring multiple indicators. We are also watching where the smart money are flowing and one of the indicators that can help us if the market structure shifted is to understand properly how the Elliott wave theory is working, right? So the absolute basics, what you need to understand for that is that when you have a corrective moves in some impulsive waves and it's against the trend, it will go in ABC pattern, right? The main trend is bearish and when you are creating ABC patterns like we had right here, ABC, it is not a high conviction for a trend continuation and you can actually with a high probability predict that the price action will reverse to the downside right we had it right here we had it also right here and we had it for the whole full seven months right here abc all the time right right now however we might have created a first five moves right that would shift the trend so as i've been explaining in the previous video this is either a b c d e but we need to really exclude this week out if we are about to calculate this week out it is another a b c which is just a correction and deviation from the major trend and because of that this breakout would be just a fake out right so in order to say that with highest probability this is really five moves not three moves we need to watch the correction right so i have been sharing with you this key supply zone right now we are rejecting out of it this is really key supply zone made from fibonacci retracement levels and high liquidity pools where there was lots of sell walls of whales of very powerful players okay so this is a very strong not to crack for Bitcoin okay so right now we are watching the reaction how we gonna correct okay how we gonna correct so first thing what will be interesting us is that how we move on a lower time frame so what we want to see in order for us to tell okay this is a real high time frame breakout we want to see this correction to move in ABC pattern right so we should go down here here we want to see some kind of reaction and then another retest of our major sub zone that should be holding we cannot break below it okay if we start reclaiming this support zone and turning it back into a resistance it will mean 
that this was indeed just a fake out and we might need another correction lower before we can continue to our major ultra high time frame target towards $93,000. However, if this gonna be a correction that will happen in ABC formation, it will mean this is just a correction countering the main trend, the main trend supposed to be bullish already, right? So this will be a confirmation that this is just a counter trade correction and the main trend is bullish and we can continue higher. For that we will need to see on a lower time frame that we will be creating this ABC pattern, right? And that we will hold this major high time frame support that was previously working as resistance and in the previous video I've already explained to you how we turned it into support we broke above it then we retest it and then we jump higher right so very important that we will be holding this major high time frame support zone and then start creating a new five moves to the upside with five waves right that will take us towards $93,000 in one go or there might be five moves ABC and another five moves right but it is really crucial to right now watch the price section also on the way down we want to see some bullish divergence right now we had bearish divergence right because on MACD the histogram have made lower high however the price made higher high that's why it was also high conviction that we will start some correction from this supply zone and as you can see nice reaction it also finished the previous target of the symmetrical triangle so that is why we knew this is going to be a high conviction trade that is why with Paradise Emily VIPs we have been able to get positioned in our swing trade right here at the top so as we drop in down and we will be going back to our support zone if we reach there we want to see some bullish divergence so on the dump down we want to see either slowdown of bearish momentum or indeed the momentum will be increasing however the price will lack following the bearish pressure and that will mean okay the bears are getting really really weak and we will start shifting towards bullish strategies and we will be able to play smartly towards $93,000 but few things we need to still keep in mind the one of the things is Bitcoin dominance as you can see we are trying to overcome the major resistance zone right now even though the Bitcoin is dropping right now minus 2% today the Bitcoin dominance is still growing what does it mean it's draining the volume and liquidity from altcoins okay so basically the Bitcoin is going down altcoins and Ethereum is also going down you can see right here Ethereum also minus 3.3 percent today okay and many altcoins based on total free index is also going down so basically the Bitcoin is going down everything is going down and the Bitcoin dominance is still growing what does it mean the Bitcoin is going going down basically smart money are selling bitcoin and outflowing that into usdt dominance that is why you can see if i shift on four hour time frame that usdt dominance is increasing plus people are selling altcoins into bitcoin that is why the bitcoin dominance is still growing right but the outflow to stable coins is so high that either though the altcoins are losing value the bitcoin dominance is still growing and getting stronger okay so we need to be very careful on that and uh, really understand that when the Bitcoin dominance is going to the upside together with Bitcoin price that been happening for a very long time it's not a very high conviction reasoning for some prolonged bullish continuation that would take us for example towards that our ultra high time frame target $93,000 okay so we really want to see the opposite right Bitcoin going down together with altcoins so we want to see Bitcoin dominance going down usdt dominance being stable or slightly growing together with dollar index going down okay but we are not seeing that just yet that is why it's kind of playing to the probabilities that this might be just a fake out okay and we might still go a little bit lower so with this kind of knowledge you can just perfectly adapt your trading strategy based on it in order to keep your odds on your side at all costs and you can be a better trader this is exactly what we are doing with Paradise.
Fridays Family VIPs. We are analyzing the market. We understand what's going on behind the scenes. And based on that, we can shape our trading strategies and trades better than everyone else. Okay, this is just the key. Together with money management and proper portfolio diversification, you can be an absolute master and stay profitable long term. This was just a quick update. I will keep you updated again on Saturday. If you have not watched the previous video, make sure you're gonna watch it where I have dived deeper into everything and I will see you on Saturday. Cheers.